coming in on those on that news development let's go, cut across to lata venkatesh uh, in conversation with the managing director at hdfc bank aditya puri over to you absolutely the most important man in uh, banking in fact in corporate india for investors mr aditya puri thank you very much for joining us mr puri pleasure lata long time yes long time absolutely long yeah. time and you said you will come when there is good news yes so that's what i want to ask you yeah we are not getting very good news when we look at data like gdp or data like iip uh, what is your sense since you lend to so many people yeah okay let let me just backtrack a bit yes we were growing well then there been a slow down for a yes. couple of quarters everybody and his brother has a view whether it's cyclical or structural suffice it to say there is a slow down which needs to be worked upon i would then like to split this into two about the medium term and the short term okay medium term the demand that will be created and i think the jp morgan people also talked about it with through urbanization through the number of rich households as well as urban and uh, semi urban and rural india where people will start mimicking the consumption patterns we think it augurs well okay. uh, we also believe that lot of the reasons without going into them in detail uh, now have changed so there's more money being pushed in oh, yes i clearly believed with the respect i have for dr jalan and dr uh, rakesh mohan that it was a very well thought out and professional and there's no such thing as gift yes they are looking very clearly at when they say divestment they're not looking only at bringing down stakes in the company they're looking at pipelines railway tracks power plants and i think that money will uh, find will find its way in and god has been kind we were a good monsoon yes all said and done oh, we are not seeing that in the numbers okay it can't be overnight no lata okay now look at your own i yeah. mean from your conference yes, call uh, you y'all have uh, provided more for unsecured retail delinquencies or decided to provide more earlier you would do that only if you're worried about retail loans absolutely not okay i'm a conservative hindustani okay so please look at it two two ways one we provided more for agri yes that agri actually. you must understand we are dealing with a farmer he dealt with a lot of catastrophes mm. we have restructured his loans it goes into npas we have provided yes. but our actual default on agri has not been high two we didn't create specific provisions we've created a contingency provision for nbfcs we also created a contingency provision as per rbi regulation for those people who didn't uh, corporates that didn't give us their unhedged exposure okay that will go away this quarter okay okay now wait 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 let me finish mm. i have please look at my 20f filing under us gap my dpd has not gone up i have no uh, worries on my portfolio my portfolio is fine have the total credit cost gone up from the last yes. two years yes that was a speech spot but they are way below my uh, built in probability of default okay. so i have no worries on the portfolio so you think that agri jump that you saw in slippages is one off is one off Okay. as we get the harvest now it will come down it'll come down further with the next harvest and i hope the government will pay their waiver oh yes of course but what about the rate of growth of loans do you think you can get back to your historical uh, rate of uh, loan growth i will not think see we don't give guidance yes so let me no, come i'm giving you a broad yeah, range so let me uh, comment for you what we have done between what we have done on digital what we have done in going into semi urban and rural india what we have done in changing our structure in terms of being able to change our cost to re revenue what we have done with straight through processing yes very clearly and india is the best financial market in the world for the next 5 years demand exceeds supply you know we so are simple answer to your question then you will answer ask me the rest yes I see no reason unless there is a major event risk to be worried either about growth or about credit quality or about margin and I see over the next 5 years my cost to revenue going down by 5%. That's for HDFC bank. Yes. But for the economy do you think uh, the I think issue is there is still a tail risk. I mean the, uh, which the loans created after 2014 ILNFS DHFL so on and so forth is this NBFC problem going to be another worry for the economy not HDFC I'll cover that also no 
So is the NBFC issue a crisis? Answer is no. Is it a problem? Answer is yes. Okay. Will it create a systemic risk? Answer is no. Because if you do not participate in the clearing, it is a bilateral between you, yes. the owner, yes. and, 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 the, investor, and the investor. So there is no systemic risk. Yes. Is there a liquidity issue for NBFCs? No. Because the creditworthy NBFCs are getting money. If you have a solvency issue, as the governor said, that is separate. Mm. So will there be some hits here and there? Uh, yes. Mm. Is it enough to create a systemic crisis? No. Okay. Is it enough to move the needle in terms of lending reduction from NBFCs? Four or five percent of the NBFCs accounted for 90 percent of the lending. Will there be some impact? Yes. Uh, for a large country like India, bade bade desh mein choti baat hoti hai. Housing, finance and realty, ye, ye kya choti baat hai? Huh? Sir, 5 lakh crore, they say, is in trouble. Uh, you know, 1.8 lakh homes uh, uh, perhaps are half built or not likely to be fully built. So first I'll talk about the banks. Mm. Banks are not allowed to lend for land. Yes. Yes. Right? They are real estate exposure. But they are housing finance companies. I mean, the financial I'll, I'll system is leveraged. It would be better if you talk to Keki, sure. but I'll try and okay. uh, listen. Okay. So let me put the real estate in perspective. Real estate and construction. Is all real estate and construction in a problem? The answer you would agree is no. no. Commercial is definitely not. Commercial not. Middle, slightly above middle and affordable, demand is not an issue. So let's boil the thing down to those luxury frats. So jisne kharida, jisne paisa diya, jis jo company ka owner hai, wo mar khayega. And even if you see what the finance minister has done, the concession is for affordable, affordable housing. Is there an issue there? Yes. Mm -hmm. Is it earth shaking? No. The prices will have to come down. Are those inventories completely useless? No. At a price they will go. Now that price has to be determined. Uh, well, actually I spoke to a lot of the people in the finance ministry. They are worried about the real estate. Uh, we should be worried. Especially in the north and western India where there are but unoccupied Lata, homes, see, half built homes. It's not my desire to be speaking through rose tinted glasses. Okay. Should a worry be there? Yes. Is there cause for concern? Yes. Is there cause for depression? No. Okay. okay. Fair enough. No. Okay. Let me just finish a little more yeah, about sure. the growth and then come back uh, ask, to HDFC ask. Bank. I wanted to ask you. We saw this, you know, first 5.6 and then 5% GDP growth. How do you think Diwali is going to be? Everyone's hopes uh, are. Diwali is going to be very good. I can tell you now. Look for this space. We, starting 27th of uh, September to the end of December, are going to come up with the biggest Diwali Dhamaka with our partners that this country has ever seen. You're sure people will bite? I'll tell you why they'll bite. Because what we have discussed with all our partners is that you can't keep raising prices okay. and the price points that will be available. And we are giving over and above whatever discount they may give. We are giving 7 to 10 percent cash back. And you're so, making, you will make 4.3 margins on that? Of course we'll make 4.3 margins on that. What do you think? I'm in the free... I, when you come to me, I'm a very good bank and a very good social citizen. Okay. I don't like to see you depressed. Yeah? Your smile should have more brightness. <laughs> and I can assure you, watch this space. And we are very convinced. And we are convinced the demand is there. We're putting a lot of money behind it. So you think the economy itself can turn calendar, fiscal to uh, FY20? Start to turn, yes. Okay, that, that's very positive coming yeah, from we you. are. I mean, I mean, that's what I wanted to hear. Let me come to one specific Please. issue of uh, external benchmarks. Yes. Now, I know your uh, situation is not bad at all yeah, because yeah. you have hardly any floating loans. But for the system, and you take some 25% of home loans from HDFC, yeah. uh, do you think external benchmarks is going to create a problem? Because for banks, the liability is fixed. They're a tough one, Lata, because the circular is already out. Now, what do I say? So but it is going to be a margin crunching? No. Now let me say, I have not done it, but please examine some of the people who have offered this loan very carefully, linked to an external benchmark. What the RBI has said is they have not told you how, how you fix your Spread. rate. So there is an interest rate risk, you add that interest rate risk. Okay. I also saw in the newspaper, without mentioning the bank, that they've also been offering this only to the higher level of customers. Yes, yes. The lower level of customers, and rightfully so, they are taking a cash margin mm -hmm. to take care of the fact that when interest rates go up, yes. then they shouldn't to. have to 
have their entire retail portfolio in NPA. Last but not the least, we are advising them at this point of time and the customers when they ask, that traditional wisdom says that when you're at the lowest point of an interest rate cycle, you fix not float your loan. Yes. So properly managed, will they be the tremendous margin compression that Lata is envisaging? My peanut brain says no. <laughs> oh, no, hardly. <laughs> okay. No, I mean, the bankers, even the, the Reserve Bank hesitated a lot on external benchmarks and finally bit the bullet. See, there was a lot of pressure on, uh, and now you're going to get me into my favorite, there's a lot of pressure on transmission. Yes. But I think we should have an equal pressure. Today morning I was reading the report, London's FX uh, volumes exceed ours and the derivative. Why? My, my, it's related to my country. So we should have a debt market. Yes. We've talked for a long time. Yes. But there are fundamentals that have to change to have uh, that uh, debt market. So if you, you must develop a bond currency and derivative. Yes, so we've spoken about that. Uh, yeah, but I think this time they should try it. Huh? You know, uh, despite the 110 basis points uh, um, uh, RBI rate cut, okay, 110, much of it has gotten passed. But the last 35, after the 35 basis cut came, we, we basis announced basis. twice the MCLR cut. Well, Once on five, five. No, no, 15 basis points last time, uh, this Monday, and 10 basis points before that. I think that's a damn good no, show. After 35, you announced only 15. Oh, okay, even yeah. that's not bad, no? 50% in one week? Okay, okay. No, no, it's not bad. Ah. The entire 35 doesn't get Are transmitted. Baba, capital government nahi deta hai. Mere ko capital shareholder deta hai. Nee, wo sahi hai. Ah. <laughs> Lekin, if you are not able to reduce, do you think... Oh, no, no, I've reduced. I'm not able to reduce within 10 days. Okay. But I can tell you the trajectory is down. I think no, the trajectory is down, but you, your it will savings happen. cost doesn't go below a level uh, because the Indian saver is used to a certain rate. No, see, there are two parts. what Rajneesh Kumar was worried about. Let's be true. I never comment on anybody else. That <laughs> okay, ah. we'll come to that. So, fundamentally, mm. given the lack of social security, liability on a floating rate is not going to take off. Okay. Yeah, we saw that before. No, no, there is a reason. I'm, I, I, because otherwise we discuss things from 20,000 feet and that's not great. Those guys want a fixed, fixed income. Rate. If you're going to float the other side, then you better have derivatives that you can cover your risk with. Pending that, even with your fixing it to your external benchmark, you will not have very much more drop in rates by the time you take interest rate risk and for the lower end of bottom. But... What this regime and this governor has done, I wish it had been done earlier. Mm. Then we wouldn't have been having this conversation. Ever since he's been keeping the money loose, yes, it's been coming back. And I can assure you that we have plans to reduce deposit rates further. And you will see further drops. And you think the saver will be able to take it? Yes. Okay, you don't see a drop in deposits. No, no. Oh, by the way, we have, we have more than enough money for anybody who wants to borrow. Come. Okay. Come yeah, on, borrow. come all. Diwali is coming. No, no. I, everybody wants to borrow, but at a lower uh, I don't, cost. Okay, lower cost also. What, you know, what if I give you twin benefit? Okay. Lower, lower cost. cost, cash back plus discount from manufacturer. Okay. That's what I'm offering. Okay. So right. please. All oh, right. And also shift your bank account to me. All right. Next time, I, otherwise no interview. I already have a bank account. Uh, uh, yes. Uh, I know where your main is. Why I have many bank accounts? Uh, I, I, my I, salary I, account is ICICI uh, Bank. Uh, but uh, I have, <laughs> my DMAT account is with uh, HDFC. I go talk to Mukesh okay. by now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is age old. Uh, Never mind. For the I'm last current. 20 years. I'm current. Uh -huh. no, no. You, well, let me come to this. See, okay. at least now this interview is not depressing. No, we no, are laughing. Not depressing. Uh, oh, downy, down, down, down. Since you have sold uh, the HDFC Bank product, yes. I'm going to ask you the question which I wanted to ask in the beginning, but I wanted to keep you happy. Okay, ask. You don't speak about other people, but the bank, you, you know, Rajesh Kumar has been very unhappy that you squared off your loan. With Rajesh the, is my very good friend. Yes, but he's a little, un, he is unhappy that you have squared it's off It's a democracy. Loan. I agree. He's but, entitled to his view. Yes. I am not unhappy. Okay. I feel strongly on the following. Mm. There should be no pooling of assets which are specifically hypothecated to a bank. That's okay. the right. That's the basis on which he lent. Okay. Even in consortium lending, you have security, and the consortium members are required to intimate the lead bank, which is done. Yes. If there is any issue, that should be raised at that point of time, not when there is difficulty. 
No, I don't think even Rajesh Kumar thinks you disobeyed the rules. I, I but don't. I, maybe you could have asked, uh, sat down and had a restructuring. Have, or, you, uh, have you heard of Sherlock? Yes, of course. Yeah. I am modern version. <laughs> I, I am here only to protect the interest of my depositors okay. as well as offer fair and competitive pricing. Okay. And people who do not behave in a proper way, I am here to kick them. Okay. Okay. No, well, they, they they ran out of money. They did they not. One bit, bit of interest. I can't talk individually about okay. customers. I think there was more than that, and that was not in good faith, and it was not rightly managed. Okay. So let's not, for everything, the banker is not, and I'm quite vocal, I'm not the scapegoat for everything. Okay. If you behave badly with me, I kick you. Okay. But do you think that uh, the, uh, this particular loan itself can be restructured? or? Uh, do you think that things have gone? You see, now you're asking on individual okay. loans, right? Okay, you. okay we'll, we'll, we'll let that. Let that it, it is an individual uh. Uh, uh, loan issue. We will okay. not talk okay. about that. Let me come back to the um, loan growth. Yes. Where do you see the loan coming? Where the loan growth coming? Will it be in consumer loans? I see loan as I told you. Because your corporate loan grew very well year on year. Yeah. But quarter on quarter it dipped a bit. And it's grown again. Okay. So our corporate has grown. Our EEG, we, we are one of the few fellows lending to the small guys, okay. has gone at an exponential rate. Okay. Our sustainable livelihood has grown at an exponential rate. Okay. Our middle market has grown very well and will continue to grow. Okay. We have focused on expanding and using the digitization and the India stack. Okay. Let's just let me give you an example. I have to sell my yes. bank also. No, 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 no go idea. ahead. Oh. I have a question on that. That's why. So, for instance, I am taking terminalization to 4 million merchants by 2021. A small, if you go to Barwa and all, you will see 100,000 of my lollipops in small places. Why? Yeah, many of my POS machines are HTML. No, right? not POS. <laughs> so I'm now using a POS app okay. because the merchant did not want to, the small merchant doesn't want to pay a charge. Okay. So he can have the QR code, which is Q, uh, quick okay. response, or he can do UPI. This takes me into semi-urban and rural India. I've gone to the small towns okay. and the 200 villages around there. All of them have what I call my super mobile app. Okay. 11 languages, he can apply for a loan. He can go to these banyas and pay by QR code. I will do 100,000 villages within the year. I'm doing 10,000 melas in semi-urban and rural India. Of all my products and my response is phenomenal. How do you manage all these app products when you don't use a mobile phone? Because I'm brilliant. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. You still can't use a mobile no, phone. No, but I'll have to explain to you. The app has got to die. It's called application processing interface. Technology is a servant. Okay. I'm also a very good executive cook. My wife hates me for that. Okay. But I can tell you what I want to eat. Okay. What price it should have, what flavor it should have, what kind of mutton it should have. And so you're able to dish it out for uh, your customers. I, I am a consumer man. Okay. I am a customer-centric man. You, you tell me what. Obsessed. Yes, you tell me what you want. I get my people to deliver, and I have the capability to do that better. Okay. You said technology is a servant. Yes. Now we've got Google Pay, and uh, WhatsApp money will come very yeah, soon. Yeah. Do you think that might take away some of? They the are my flow? biggest partners. Okay. I am offering. When I said application interface, I have taken my technology platform. I must send you the book. Have you read Nandan's forward on? Tamil Pandapathy's no, book. No, I didn't. I, didn't. I would suggest you read this yes. because you're not getting a, a feel of what I've done in okay, technology. Okay. I put an API platform. Because of that, I have my API installed in Google. Google. Okay, okay. So when you are in Google. So when I'm doing a Google Pay, I'm actually using your. No, I'm not talking about Google Pay. You're oh, talking sorry. about a small thing. Okay, okay. Go when ahead. you enter Google, you can execute my product okay. on the Google platform. Okay. Because of my API, from there I will get the response into my customer identifier, which will pass it to my credit guy, which will pass it to my marketing fellow, all in one second. Okay. Okay. And I have got also major discussions with the CEO of Facebook, global, uh, not the CEO, global head of Facebook. Okay. And we feel for semi-urban and rural India, we will change the landscape. We're just waiting for the approval. Mm -hmm. I see them as a partner. Now let me first further go to you. What all these guys have done, when you talk Google Pay, this, that, ultimately, and all these so-called fintechs, so let me cover this once and for all. They are riding OTT mm -hmm. over the top. That's my system. Yes, yes, yes. By putting an API. 
Why can't I put my own, my own API and give you the same service? Now, a lot of banks are using UPI for the same purpose. No, but, but I'm coming. I'm coming. So basically, I don't make my, my, much money on the payments business. Okay. Okay. Then you're not losing much. So uh, the, the fintechs are great in Brazil. You know what the uh, uh, MDR charge in Brazil is? 15%. Uh, sorry, 6%. Okay. You know how much? Uh, but you know when they pay? T plus 15. Oh. They will be murdered. Okay. We have ridiculous charges here. Yeah. But it's not that I'm totally altruistic. I will make very good money in semi-urban and rural India, but I've taken my products all over. Okay. Similarly, I want to see a fintech that doesn't loan in 10 seconds. Well, they may. So okay. How? They have to come to me finally, you know? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. It, is, it is a system that the banks uh, uh, have already laid. Yeah. Now, other banks have also, for instance, BOB has gone very high on UPI. Other banks are also using the UPI and they're hoping to mine the data. Do you see more competition in the consumer loan space for you? Until now, you were king. Yeah. Uh, now you may get very severe king competition. King is born a king, man. No, no, king became a king. So then, now... Uh, I've also been a reporter from 1994. So then, uh, I've seen the king. Now, hereditary. Grow. After that, hereditary. As far as LDSC Bank is concerned. Okay. With or without me, with or without me, they will be king. You're taking away my next question. No, <laughs> with, uh, I'm putting a more humorous dimension to it. Okay. With or without them, they will be king. So the point is that when they come in, the demand exceeds supply in India. And this opportunity is an 18 to 20 billion do dollar opportunity over the next seven years. Okay. There's enough for all of no us. There's no need to jostle for space. There's, there's no need to jostle for But that does not mean that when I say I, as surrogate for HDFC Bank, will not be king. Okay. Because we're first mover. Let's take semi-urban and rural. 53% is there. I've tied up with CSC. Okay. I'm introducing 100,000 feet on street, selling my products. Okay. I've digitized and increased. I'm going to be opening how many thousands of banking correspondence. That's a new bank in itself. That's different from customer service centers? Yeah, the customer service centers, centers, yeah, but it's, it's equivalent to 60% lives there. Yes, yes. This coincides with the, what the government is doing. Yes in terms of trying to change the architecture, what God is doing with the monsoon, yes. and what is coming in. Okay. So I'm very happy. Okay. Well, fair enough. Now, since you were speaking about, you know, uh, yeah. king sh a kingdom or kingship is inherited. No, kingdom is there. Yeah, kingdom is there. New king. Who is it? Long live the king. Oh, king. What, what do you think are the challenges for your success? Uh, First of all, is the process already started? Process, internally, yes. We will appoint a search committee in January. Now, there are two things we could do for this. Firstly, my one down has been running their businesses and all investors have met them for the last one and a half years, okay. number one. Number two, I, I don't know how much time we have, if the, okay. the strategy mm. in terms of what we will do for technology, for customers, retail, wholesale, uh, the platforms, the people's training is not a bird in the air, it's all there. Okay. to be executed. Mm. Thereafter, we will look, and unless you're presuming mm. that God was totally unfair and there are no bright people in the world, True. we will not hire a dodo. <laughs> no, your investors clearly are, or at least they the share be. price is showing a little bit of uh, a Yeah, they should, That's but right. I'm, I'm reducing it by each month. Okay. So okay. I, we are at the JP Morgan conference. Yes. They asked me that. Mm. And I said, they said, what will happen? I said, just watch the results every quarter from now, see the momentum, and talk to me in February. And if you're not convinced, then you've not applied your mind. Left to you, should it be an insider or an outsider? At it's ADHD? not left to me, so I cannot but take if away. If it were, hypothetically. It should be the best man. Okay. That 20 years you've been interviewing me. When am I going to give you an answer <laughs> as you want? <laughs> All right, Mr. Puri, <laughs> thank, thank you, you very much. A pleasure. It's, it was the most enjoyable 20 minutes we've had. Good. <laughs> thank you. Take okay. care. Okay. फैमिली के साथ एक भी मोमेंट गवाना नहीं चाहिए जो फ्यूचर आप उनके लिए देख रहे हैं